Good morning, grumpy head. I'm not grumpy. She's grumpy, I think. I'm the only one who does directions. Hey, good morning. Um, it's like just before, or maybe it is eight now. Um, and we'll have Seven breakfast. And we're walking to a JR station so we can use our JR pass. It's about a kilometer away. And then we're gonna catch the train to Tenaruji Temple. And then when you walk through the gardens of that temple, it takes you to the Arashimama. Arashima. Arashima bamboo forest. So. We try to get there early. We should hopefully yeah. be there by 8 30, but it's had a new train in the face. I don't think we could get up any earlier than what we did, so. I'm still exhausted. Yeah, we've done our best. Hopefully, it's not too crowded at this time. Yeah. Is that 10 minute train ride? Yeah. Now we're it's only 8.30 and it's boiling. Yeah, it's very hot. Um, yeah. Hopefully this is towards Bamboo Forest. Towards Tenaruji Temple is where we're starting off. We're starting off. This vlog. And they say to go to the Tenaruji Temple and then you can go out the back of that into the forest and you kind of skip the crowds at the entrance. So we're going to do that hopefully, mm. if we can find our way there. We crowd. kind of rushed through the other temple, even though we paid, but it's 500 yen. But we did come for this. We yeah, wanted this to be as quiet as possible. Oh, it's really hot. Oh, it's Somewhere we just had the worst bus ride ever. <laughs> so we were waiting for One ages. We thought on my phone it said it was JR, so we were like, sweet, like we won't have to pay. Um, and we waited, three of our bus went past, but they were all like, we looked at them and we were like, no one can fit on, and then like 10 more people squished <laughs> on. Legally packed. And then finally the fourth one came, and I was like, we just have to go. Like, if we don't go now, we're not getting on one. And so we went on and we got pushed so much. It was like, I barely would, fit in. The door closed on like my back. You would not be allowed that many people no. on a bus in Melbourne. No. It was not pleasant. I don't no. know if this temple was going to be worth it. And then we. My eyes cringe. Yeah, that's. <laughs> I pointed to. And it's then, worth it. <laughs> and then we went to walk off. 
the bus and showed our JR pass and like everyone was trying to get off at once and he was like no like they don't work here you have to pay so then we were trying to find all the coins as everyone's trying line. to get off sorry but we made it but now it's ice cream time <laughs> she's much happier now that she's got her so yeah the other day she had matcha and vanilla but this one's green tea and vanilla but it tastes the same yeah I really like it. I got vanilla because I'm vanilla. <laughs> and look at all the vending machines. Yeah. They've got clear Fanta. They've got green tea. Mm, they have Hagen Dazs vending machines. How cool is that? Look at in here. You all know that one. As you can see, everywhere gets incredibly busy. This is why it's important to come early. There are like 20 buses full of people. Pretty crazy. And even this morning when we went to Bamboo Forest, we got there before nine and I think two buses had already two buses arrived at the people. same time. So you, you can't really, I don't know, because we've never got there earlier than that, but it'd be hard, I think it's hard to get to anywhere yeah. without. Yeah, we literally get there at like 7am. Yeah. We're wrecked. We've had enough. So we decided to get our first taxi off the trip. I'm not even ashamed and I don't regret it. Do you? <laughs> also, I forgot to say that when we got in, the doors opened by themselves. Yeah. Japan is the future. And just like that, we're back at the hotel. Our cab was so expensive. It was like 2,500 yen. A bit steep, it's over $30 for like a 15 minute drive or something, <laughs> but it's worth it. Back now it's 5 past 12, so we've done so we've done well. We've done two major tourist things today, and they, that was our goal for the, the day, so we've already done that. But we got lunch, we did a 7 Eleven lunch again to save some money. I got this weird, it's one of these rice things again, but this flavor is taco rice. Which should be interesting, and then I got tomato and cheese pizza. And Rosh got another egg salad sandwich. <laughs> and a um it's a soy sauce tuna mayo kind of sushi thing. Yeah. So these are really good. Like these are at every single like 7-Eleven or Family Mart mm. or Lawson. They have all different flavours. Um, I really like the chicken and vegetable one, and then the other they have day... They one just vegetable as well. Oh, yeah. Like vegetable, mushroom and something. That was mushroom nice. and vegetable. Um. And I also tried one the other day. I think it was just called grilled rice. So it was kind of like flavoured seasoned rice, and it was a bit kind of crunchy on the outside, and it was really good. But yeah, no, they're really yum. Nice and easy. I mean, this one was 125 yen, so that's like a dollar fifty Australian. Australian, so that's pretty good. You couldn't get anything for lunch at that price at home. No. No. Um, but they also have like, we keep getting these, but they also have like bigger meals and like salads yeah, and like stuff. But anyways, we're just going to chill out for a few hours. We're not sure when we'll go out again. We've got really sore feet and like we've already done the things we wanted to do today. Um, I'm very keen to just have a bit of rest. Yeah. And we've got Universal Studios in two days, so we really don't want to have our feet be this sore. Then. We'll probably rest and then maybe in the evening we'll go for a wander and have dinner out, maybe. Maybe. Yeah. Bye. Bye. We're at this gyoza place. Arigato gozaimasu. Arigato gozaimasu.
and they have dessert here as well. Yum. Hopefully we haven't ordered too much. They've also got some vegan options. They've got chocolate banana gears on. A vegetarian option. A vegetarian menu. Like, yeah. it's not just one thing, there's lots of options. There's mashed potatoes. We got this one and this one. Mushroom, mushroom. Uh, soy pulp. Yeah. Pretty good, not something we've come across a lot, so I'm pretty happy. I'm going to get the dessert ones. Yeah. If we don't explode. Yeah. <laughs> it's in the morning, yeah. I enjoy watching the same. What is this one? Michael. Pork. Oh, my God. Chicken and mozzarella. Um, yeah, I think this one's a vegan, so it's tofu and um, something like soy sauce, wrapped in soy sauce skin or something like that. Chicken. Deep fried chicken. And then we're still waiting on deep fried mashed potato with gyoza. Deep fried mashed potato. Each plate has kind of come with its own sauce that they recommend, and the mashed potato ones they put like salt on the plate, so they get to mix it with them. You mean the mozzarella and chicken? Oh, mozzarella and chicken, sorry. So interesting. Oh, it's like <laughs> I'm afraid. I'm going to wait to finish up. That's too expensive. Okay, um, interesting. So you can tell that the outside of these tastes different, but it's not bad. In a bad way. Mm -hmm. What do you think about the potato ones? Also, a lot of food gyoza had an option. You can either get it just grilled like pan fried, or you can get it. Deep fried. <laughs> yeah. So we got our potato ones deep fried. We've now got our dessert. We've got chocolate gyoza with vanilla ice cream. Very sad. Now the same as Ryan. Oh, all right. They're hot. They're hot. Oh. It's gonna be like Nutella roti. <laughs> so this is where we just had the best goddamn dessert gears as you'll ever have in your goddamn life. So yum. So yum. So yum. That was the best dinner we've had. Ever. Yeah. And Stace just said that she'd come back here just, just to have dessert. those dessert dumplings. So I wouldn't be surprised if we do find ourselves back here tomorrow even though we have no time. <laughs> Really good dinner, like really good selection, like lots of different vegetarian options. Uh, yeah, it was just good. Just good. Howdy, everybody. We just got back from our night out. We had those yummy dumplings, um, and then we went for a bit of a stroll. We walked past the Pacino Stace, Pacino machine. Stace is in the shower. I'm about to have a shower. Um, and we went in and that was crazy. It was so loud and they're like, you can't even hear yourself think. It smells like smoke. But it's just like sensory stimulation overload. Uh, would not recommend. Stace wanted to try the machines, but we didn't understand how it works. Um, and then we kept walking and found an arcade. We're unsuccessful again. I've lost track of how much money we've spent trying to get a soft toy. But we're gonna try again in Osaka because we've no control uh, and tomorrow we're gonna go see one more temple and then we're gonna go get the yummy like fluffy pancakes that I think Japan's known for and the drinks that are shaped as animals uh, Stace wants to get the dessert gyoza again don't know if we'll have time and then we're gonna go to Osaka and that's where we're gonna end our trip uh, we're staying in an Airbnb tomorrow so this is our last hotel anyway see you then <laughs>